Hi guys, this is my latest creation. Please keep on watching. <laughs> Hi guys, today uh, with no further ado, I'm moving right along. I don't want this to be too, uh, so what we're going to do, I'm going to take three kinds of gels. I'm going to take clear gel, clear pink, and white. What I'm going to do is that I'm going to do marble nails. So today we're going to do the easiest nail art I ever done, which is called marbled nails. So now I... Put my tree kind. You see what I you seen what I just did. Now I'm just gonna swoop it on my nail, okay? And the thing here is you don't want to play with it too much. I might say that a bit in the video, but it's a very good tip. So there, I'm just looking at it, and it looks good, looking good, looking good. So I'm just gonna cure that for a minute and a half. Okay, so I'm going to pause the video and I'll be right back. Okay, so my nail is cured. <clears throat> so now what I'm going to do, I'm going to file the, th the, the tip because the tip, excuse my accent, because the, the tip uh, on top here, uh, it really needs to be thinner. If the tip of your nail is thicker, sorry, this hand is not done yet. Well, I was practicing on these two. <laughs> Anyways, that's another story. So basically, I'm just going to put back my gloves so I don't distract myself and get off topic here. <laughs> so basically, uh, what I have here is, um, see, it came out and I find like I have a nice marble. But, and the thing with when you do marble like this, you don't want to play with it too much because it's just going to be like a big slob. I'm fortunate this did not happen. So now what I'm going to do, I'm just going to buff it because gel likes a rough surface. So I'm just going to buff it just like so. It doesn't have to be, um, I can grab uh, there. And I'm just going to buff like the entire nail just a little bit. I don't want to remove anything. I just want to make it a little rough. But I really like my intention is not to remove or anything like that. So... Maybe if I go like this, maybe it's better. I don't know. There. My phone is moving. It's because I asked my phone to focus on my nail here. Hey, I don't know if it's going to do that. But if it does, that's good technology, Samsung. So I'm just going to leave it as be on top. And hopefully I still have some color. I'm going to check. Because, you know, you don't want to. Oops. So. Sorry, guys. I'm just grabbing for a paper. Okay. There. Yes, I still have my marble. I'm very happy. So now I'm just going to concentrate on my tip. If I lose all the color on my tip, I don't mind because I know I'm coming back with a color. So I'm just going to file. So the only thing I'm going to do... I, so there you go. I'm not going to leave it alone until it's thin enough. Just going to crank it up a bit so it doesn't stall. Okay, I'm just going to have a look at it because... I might. I would rather maybe finish it with the file. Yeah, that's better. I'm a freak like that when it comes to my cuticles. Now, see, I have my shine. I have my shine. I have my um, gel polish with glitters in it. And I'm going to... I don't know. I hope this is good. So now what I'm going to do is that I'm going to grab one of the colors I wanted to use. And I'm going to bring back my little gel thing. And I'm going to put a nice fat drop of this. I mean like, you know, dapisha. 
Then I'm going to grab my first time trying these little, uh, these little brushes. I don't really know. I'm just going to condition it first in here. Voila. So now I'm going to grab this with a little bit of this and a little bit of this. And I'm going to come here and I'm going to marble. Just going to marble where I feel like a little drop of color wouldn't hurt. So I'm just going to scoop it all again. And again, I'm just going to... Because the problem I have is that sometimes I overdo it. And I really don't want to over... Am I overdoing it, guys? No, I think this is going to look good. Okay, so I'm just going to bring a little piece up here. Okay, so I'm going to cure it before it's too late. So I'm going to cure this, guys, for 60 seconds. So I'll pause and I'll be right back. Okay, so I just came out uh, of the lamp. This is my nail. I'm going to grab a little bit of IBD clear hard gel I'm gonna put it sorry I'm always off focus on this thing so there I'm gonna put it and I'm just gonna inlay all of this inside of here oh my shaky little left hand again oh I just got my phone oh 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 oh, oh. this is so hard like this you know like just I'm just going to have to make a slip layer because it's not working out for me. A slip layer is like a thin layer of gel that will tell your gel where you want it to go. That's what they say what it is. And then what I love about gel is that if I can brace myself. I like I really like to have like I really want to have like a nice apex, but I don't really know how high I should put it. Sorry guys, maybe I'm playing too much with my gel, but I think I'm going to go like that. It's wonky, but I'm not going to fix it, or am I? Yes, I am. Just going to bring that over here so you can see me work, maybe. <laughs> How about that? So, I'm just going to, you know, like guide my gel, like. Make sure I have some everywhere. So when I file, I'm going to turn it. Do I have an arch? Yeah. I'm just going to go like that and then like that to make sure. Okay. I'm going to look at my nail on every side. And it's, it's going into the, oh shoot i caught it look i caught it when i went in and i caught it right there little 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 oh, okay so it's now out of the lamp so i'm gonna wipe the sticky residue or the dispersion layer and then this is my nail oh i'm liking it See, it's really cute. Oh, I like that. Okay, so I'm just going to shape it now because it's kind of, you know, crooked. And when I shape my nails, I usually have my hands closer to me. So I'm going to pause it. I'm going to shape this one. And uh, I'll be back to work on these. Okay, be right back. Okay, so I'm equipped. This is uh, by Young Nails. I had that when I ordered the beginner's gel kit on Amazon. I paid it like $50, but it's now on special in Canada for $30 on Amazon, so I don't know. So that's what I'm gonna use. 
and uh, it's a high gloss gel sealer it's gonna seal everything in and then what I'm gonna do I'm gonna add some uh, bling -ing -ing. just a second I'm just gonna put my hand at a place that everybody can see okay so here I am just oh it goes so well when I can actually brace myself Okay, so just going for it, going, going for it, and then I'm just going to check if my tip is not too, ugh, the tip is thick, just a second guys, I'm just going to get rid of some gel. Now the tip is all right. I think, yeah, it's proportioned. So now I'm gonna grab a nice pink bead and I'm gonna drop it. I'm just gonna set it where I like it. And I like it when it sits here. I'm gonna put it right in the center of the What I love about gel is that you can play with it as long as you want. Now I'm going to look at it this way. This one looks like it's pink. And it is. I wish you guys could see me grab my okay so So just finishing my nails here just you know I just wanted to show you guys a little bits and pieces of what I was doing not to take too much time so that's that here it is okay guys so this is the moment this is the moment when I put my top coat on and we'll see the final results so I'm just gonna there 
there just to make sure we can see the so just to see and whatever I filed off if I filed off something don't forget I just wanted it to be no I didn't and it came out pretty awesome just saying I had low expectations <laughs> Just to let you guys know. Okay, so here it is, guys. My uh, cuticles are a mess and everything. But, oops, and I'm like oversized. I don't need that. So basically, this is what it looks like. Okay, it's really cute. Uh, I like it. So what I'm going to do with those, uh, I'm actually going to do another video where I'm going to bling them up like this. Not at this same, but it's going to be like a team going on. Cling or whatever. So anyways, I just want to really thank you guys for watching today. You guys are great. Thank you for watching. Have a beautiful day. Don't forget to smile because it's contagious. And uh, it will make you and somebody else feel better. So thank you for joining me on my marbled glitter nails. And uh, please subscribe. I would really appreciate it. And like and share and all that good stuff. Bye-bye.